Okay, class 5, you can now take out your uh, English grammar. So, we will do, uh, so as we finish this chapter, right, we'll, we'll do revision. Understood? <coughs> so we'll do revision that uh, it can be easy for you. Okay? So... The sentence, phrase, and clause. Yeah? So, question answers I already given. D do it, uh, uh, sorry, prepared uh, for, for unit test. Okay, first unit test. And uh, from, uh, from grammar portion, we have fourth chapter. Yeah? So, I already uh, given you question answers. Please uh, uh, learn question answers as well as practicals, okay? As well as objectives. I will mix it and I will give it to you. And uh, <clears throat> so, okay. So here are some... Um, <clears throat> The sentence, phrase, and clause. Question answer I already given you. Yeah. So what is sentence? Sentence is a group of word that express a complete meaning. Yeah. Which convey which convey the complete meaning or as a, a complete uh, sense is called sentence. For example, you can see the examples. A lot of examples are there. Do you know apple? This is a complete example. Yeah, it makes sense. That means, do you know? It asking a questions. Okay, it 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 asking a question that do you know? Eh, sorry, do you like apples? So this is a complete sentence which convey the complete in a complete manner is called which um. A sentence which convey in a complete manner is called sentence. Understood? Go through it. Okay. So, sentence are of what kinds? Sentence are of uh, five kind. Okay. Assertive, affirmative, uh, sorry, assertive, informative, interrogative, extra exclamatory optative so all these understood till five there are five kind of sentence so assertive sentence is that which express a fact okay or a statement or declaration okay like that so <clears throat> for example the big animal trumpet loudly so big okay big elephant that means it expresses how big an animal or an elephant is okay so it expresses assertive sentence is a statement as well as declaration that this elephant is big okay so <clears throat> Assertive sentence is that which express a fact, okay, which express as a positive declaration. Okay, second number is, there are, uh, there is a difference also. Second number is, interrogative means to investigate, to ask a question, okay. And, if you see this example, see those examples, you can find this is a interrogative, uh, sorry, this is an interrogative sentence. So, does your brother work? Question mark, question mark, question mark, and question mark. Yes or no type questions, okay? Next one is imperative sentence express a command. Okay, request or order or advices. Okay, so 
imperative sentence is that which denotes what command uh, which denotes uh, request advice and all okay example like leave the room immediately okay when the teacher come and teacher says that sit down is also uh, in uh, also an imperative sentence okay the command request advice and order all these sentences are called imperative sentence next one is exclamatory sentence exclamatory sentence is that which express feelings okay which express feelings emotions and all okay so if you see this example how lovely the peacock is yeah next one is optative sentence optative sentence expresses prayers okay it denotes prayer for example god bless you may god bless you may god fulfill uh fulfill your uh, dreams may god fulfill your desires and all may uh, god uh, success you okay so all these uh, prayers uh, will be your optative sentence okay and part of a sentence so part of a sentence is that there are two part of a sentence that is subject and a predicate subject is that subject uh, is uh, subject is that which well, which is um, which something is said about somebody okay subject is that which is said about somebody okay but predicate is that which just said about the subject understood so subject and predicates are the part of a sentence okay in a sentence subject a subject will be there and predicate also will be there okay it's a part of a sentence subject which is said about somebody and predicate which is said about the subject okay here are some uh, tables uh, so some uh, examples of subject and predicates okay phrase clause okay phrase a group of word that makes sense okay it's just like a like a like a sentence kind of a sentence okay so phrase is that which makes a sense but not in a complete manner is called phrase okay so like uh, on the wall in the short time in the evening across the country all these things are belonging to phrase kind of a phrase executive phrase adverb phrase noun phrase are three type of three kind of phrase for example executive phrase executive phrase is that uh okay uh, is, is okay sometimes a group of word does the work as an executive for example the chinese animal uh, armies were defeated so the uh, qualify okay the uh, quality or the qualifying uh, words are belong to executive phrase okay adverb phrase this phrase belongs to a work okay like we have seen that something a group of words this is the work as the adverb god is everywhere it means work okay it belong adverb belongs adverb means work okay so god is everywhere and in every places okay so noun phrase is that a phrase that does not uh, does the work of a noun 
is called noun phrase since nouns nouns are used as subject or as object of verb phrase which do such work are noun phrase so these things understood so noun are the noun phrase it belongs to a name okay it belongs to a subject understood for example they my brother she so it's a it's have a subject okay clause a clause is a part of a longer sentence it forms the grammatical intent uh, uh, intent in itself but is not necessarily complete logical or a grammatical sentence so clause is that which clause is a part of a longer sentence okay it's a longer sentence or as it's a kind of a predicate okay and it forms a grammatical grammatical identity in itself only okay so here we finish our first chapter revision work so i hope you got it and do some revisions uh revision works and do prepared for your uh, first unit test okay so till then goodbye everyone